Oh, what's going on guys? How you all doing today? And welcome back to another vlog. The video is where I film what I get up to on a weekly basis with my son, Benjamin. This week we're actually on a lovely nature walk in Kenilworth because it is really hot and the best place to bring Benjamin when it's hot is somewhere nice and shady. And thanks to the beautiful nature, we have natural shade here in, uh, in Kenilworth's little woods. Oh, Benji, should we build a den? Look at this little den look. Wow, look at that, Benji. So it looks like some kids have made a little den here. I remember as a kid, I spent most of my childhood actually climbing trees and building dens and stuff like that. So this is like the perfect place for me. And in an effort to be a good parent, I want Benjamin to spend as much time outside as possible and not all the time glued to a television or his phone or his iPad gaming and all that kind of stuff. Because as much as I am a gamer myself and I love doing that, I honestly think it's really important for kids to get out and actually play and do things outside because it's, uh, it's good to get some sun in you. The one downside to this place is that sometimes it gets really narrow and full of thorns and stuff, and I have to carry Benjamin, which can get a little bit precarious at times uh, as we navigate our way through the woods. Oh, not long to go before in a couple of weeks, I'll be on a plane and we're going to Italy. I haven't actually told you guys yet, but yeah, in a couple of weeks, I'm actually going to Italy for like three nights, I think, four days. Uh, so we're gonna get to explore Italy, which would be nice. We'll get our first like abroad holiday. And it's the first time I'm actually flying without parents because I haven't been on holiday for like 10 years. So I'm super excited to do that. As far as a kid, I used to come out into places like this. We used to collect like leaves and stuff like that and then paint them and put them in books. Uh, and like, it was like leaf printing or something. I wonder if that'd be a cool idea to do. Maybe we should actually do that. All right, Benji, should we collect some leaves? Should we get some of these? Like get one of each, ready? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this little leaf here, look, like this one, pluck him off like this. <gasps> yeah. Oh, here's a different type of leaf, Benji. Get that one of those then, like that, look. There we go. And then we add it into the bag. Yeah. 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 Oh, what about this one, Benji? This is a different type of leaf, look. There you go. Thank you. Another leaf for the collection. Got a new one here, look. You want to get one of those? Yeah. Just one. Ready, pull. There it is. Right, one more leaf up there. You see it? Grab it. How about that one? Yeah. All right, I think we've collected all the leaves we could possibly get right now. I think we should head to Tesco and get like a little notebook or something. All right, we're back home and out of the sweltering heat because it is, oh my God, it's so hot in England. But we've been to Tesco and we've had a change of plan. So we've got some PVA glue. We've got some fuzzy sticks for like legs. We've got some glue spreaders to spread the glue and we've got some goggly eyes and a canvas. And of course, all of the leaves that we collected earlier. And what I'm thinking is, Benjamin picks his favorite leaf here and we're gonna basically draw a person here with googly eyes on a leaf. So we set the time lapse up and see what Benjamin can do. I think that's a pretty good job. I think we just need to sign it and then let it dry. Okay then, here we go. Ta-da! What have you made there, Benji? Look. Wow, good job. Well, if it wasn't obvious, it's been a couple of days since the last clip. And Benji is determined to go to Daddy's car, so I think we're going out. Are we going out? So I think we're gonna go down to the allotment for a little bit uh, and do some bits and bobs on there. However, it does look like it's about to rain a lot and it's very, very windy. But without further ado, let's go. All right, we have arrived. And Benjamin's choice of outfit today is full on yellow. <laughs> but we're down at the allotment. Things are starting to get a little bit overgrown with weeds coming through in the flower bed. I think we need to start harvesting some stuff soon, but yeah. It needs to work. We need to cut the grass. I need to source a lawnmower from somewhere. Because I can't see myself cutting the grass with some scissors. That being said, in the shed, we do have like a manual um, like lawnmower, which is obviously, I don't know how good it's gonna be. So I guess we can give that a go. Uh, we'll do it a couple, like once or two, two times over. See if we cut the grass uh, and, and go from there. But with this thing, my hopes aren't high. We're also gonna try and use this bad boy because I've never used it before. So we're gonna set that up now uh, and set the time lapse up and see if we can actually cut any grass of it. So here's to hoping that you actually stay right where you are and the time lapse works just fine. I'm really hoping that that looks different. But if I'm honest, 
It kind of just looks the same as that. Oh, thank you, Spongy. Somehow the onions have turned to apples. Do you know what anything about that? What's the apples? They're not meant to be there, are they? But not too far off. Obviously, I need a little bit more on them. I think they're actually cooking Daddy. apples from that tree over there. But you can't eat them yet. They're not ready. Yes, ready. Not ready yet. Yes, ready, yeah. Well, I'm not 100% sure if this will do the job, but if we can trim some of the grass down the edge here, that would help a lot. But I don't know. They actually might be sharp enough. So let's uh, do a bit of trimming, shall we? And get rid of some of these weeds and long grass that's going through. And I guess Benjamin can help this trowel. <laughs> and with impeccable timing, it is now started to piss it down. Ugh, right, well, that's all she wrote for the allotment. On to destination number two. Oh, ho, ho, McDonald's acquired. Time to hit the road. at another agricultural show but this one is the Cotswolds and thankfully it's an absolutely beautiful day out today uh, because all week it's actually been raining like crazy so I'm in shorts and a t-shirt so is Benjamin and uh, we're gonna go and see what's what oh but geez look at all these tractors eh good old-fashioned ones which one's your favorite Benjamin yes, look at that one yes, got treads on everything oh my god would you look at this that is seriously cool holy shit look at that you know what this reminds me of? It reminds me of Back to the Future uh, when they come back on a steam train. That's pretty sick. I'm actually in awe at this thing. Like, I assume it's like a steam tractor where they used to pull back uh, to do farming back in the day, but it's pretty cool. And I can't describe it, but the smell is amazing. So this guy's got a fan tour and it runs all the way into that, which runs the engine for it. Crazy. Oh, look at this. Some real life stiffing happening right in front of me. Bruce K. Pyrell. Oh, look at him. Wow, look at that. I want one of those really badly. This is something you definitely won't see me doing. What do you reckon? We're going to see a backflip. Here he goes. Hey. Crazy. What's that? I don't think Benjamin understands whether it's actually a, a real thing or not. He's just tried stroking it a minute ago. Damn, you see combine harvesters on like Jeremy Clarkson's farm and stuff like that, but they're actually so big in person. It's just fucking huge, man. Which is definitely what she said. Wow, you got a new hat, Benji. You want to wear it backwards? Is it backwards cooler? No, oh, you look like a proper little farmer. You, you like it, don't you? Well, Benjamin wants to sit in the digger instead down here. Fits in perfectly as well. I think this might be the first time I've seen Benjamin on a council, actually. <laughs> he looks happy. Ring the bell, ring the bell. Hi. Well, that brings the show to an end, and just as well, really. Because that cloud is coming our way, and I think it's going to rain soon. This is most definitely the coolest thing I have seen all day here, though. Jesus Christ, they're so cool. But I think it's time to head back to the car and go find some food. Oh, we're back home, and honestly, this week's vlog... Don't even get me started. The house is a bomb site because we are getting ready to go on holiday. This guy's losing his mind. But long story short, I've been hella busy for the last couple of weeks. I haven't actually been able to film anything. Uh, I've just been working a lot. And then obviously I've been all over the place with everything. The weather's been letting me down despite it being like sunny for a lot of this vlog. Most days during the week, it's looked like this. Which has meant I've not been able to actually go down the allotment and film what I wanted to do because I wanted like a full allotment vlog before I went on holiday, which I'm doing next week. So yeah, everything's a go. I'm kind of planning. We've got all of the small, tiny things for the holiday. So next week on Friday, you'll be seeing a vlog from me in Italy of all places. I'm super excited to do that. So I'm kind of trying to wrap things up today whilst obviously wasting no XP. Hi. But yeah, sorry that we haven't uh, posted a vlog for the last couple of weeks. So the videos have been a bit all over the place. Uh, we're trying to keep on top of it, but we've got lots of plans for the next couple of weeks, so there should be some fun vlogs coming up. Want you want a biscuit? He wants a biscuit. Yeah. What do you say? Happy. Please, Daddy. Please, Daddy. And what, then what do you say? Happy. Good boy. Unfortunately, sometimes the vlogs are going to be like this, where I don't actually just do anything on a weekly basis, or the weather lets me down because it's raining. I did have plans to, like, bake a cake and, like, do some more cooking stuff with Benjamin, but on honestly, it's been all over the place. Benjamin's not been here a lot for the last couple of weeks because he's been staying away at his, like, his grandparents'. It's just, it's, it's been a palaver. But either way, I hope you've enjoyed this incredibly messy vlog. If you did enjoy this video, please give the video a thumbs up, Ren. I'd appreciate that. If you're new around here, feel free to subscribe. But as always, 
been a Ryan. I love your faces and I shall see you next week when I'll be in Italy. So I'll catch you guys there. Peace, peace. Bye-bye. I have traveled 5,000 blocks and I have reached the edge of the world. I still not found a pissing cactus. I just want a cactus. That's all I need in my life right now. Where's the cactus? <laughs> you know what? Hello, donkey. Me and you are going to be from friends.